You look at Felice Herrig, and what do you see, uh, technically speaking, as far as, you know, fighting that particular style type and body type and the matchup coming up? What, what do you expect? What do you see from her? Um, yeah, you know, I know she's a veteran in the sport. She's been around for a lot longer than I have. Uh, she is known for her kickboxing. She has a kickboxing background um, or the Muay Thai background. So I'm preparing for that. But I just I, I can't underestimate any any part of her game plan. You know, I, I know she's going to come at me full force and she's going to be my strongest competitor. And I just have to prepare for anywhere the fight can go. You get hit with the personal side of it, <laughs> of course. But, you know, I, I know that all the guys on my team, they, they've been there for me, especially when... Um, they, they get it a lot too so I just stay off social media I have to understand that it's it's just being uh, it's just a fight being built it's just a fight at the end of the day it's just a fight and it is the biggest fight of my career and that's I, that's the only thing I'm focused on right now but at the end of the day it's just a fight and, and no matter what happens um, life goes on you know being on this platform you're going from fight pass up to Fox. It's a huge platform for you. I'm sure you are viewing this as the biggest fight of your career. Um, how are you kind of just taking that in stride? Do you do kind of, does that go into your thought process about, wow, I'm going to be competing on network television, or is this just simply, it's another fight for me, and it's it's the win that I'm after on Saturday? Um, you, know, you know, actually for me, it's every fight has been the biggest fight of my career. My, my first fight ever, my amateur, um, I had one amateur fight, so it's like that was the biggest thing I've ever done is to have a, a, a fight, you know? And then after that, I, I had a pro debut. So and that was the biggest fight of my life. And it's like every single time I fight, it's the only thing on my mind. And no matter what outside things are going on or whether it's for a Fox card or whether it's for a small local show, I always, it's, it's the only thing that matters. So every fight's the biggest fight and I, I try not to let the nerves get to me. Police will pull down. Felice, what comes to mind uh, when we say Paige Van Zant and what we expect on April 18th and your impressions of, of Paige Van Zant, who's obviously getting a, a lot of exposure at this point in her career, and, and that's one of the main focuses of this card on April the 18th? Uh, I think it's all hype, and I think it, it, the hype stopped April 18th. You know, Paige hasn't done anything really relevant in her career um, to, to keep the momentum going. And I think that's key. You know, I've been solid and I've been consistent in my career and, and I've I've earned everything that I have and I've made my own opportunities. Um, so, like I said, I, you know, I, I think that, that Paige has, you know, a lot of hype right now, but I, I just think that it's, it's, it's all going to end April 18th.